Hey everyone, just gonna do a bit of traveling down this uh, south road that I was on the other day. Got the video camera mounted to the hardware to the window. This way I can drive and have a look around and if anything happens to pop in front of the camera then uh, we'll get it. Monday morning had some snowfall. Really nobody out here that I've seen except for two people. I go just go nice and slow. I don't have to worry about traffic trying to get around me. Usually there's not too many people out here anyway. second time up here so I'm just kind of driving around. I've stopped at a few spots and had looks. Uh, with the recent snow I haven't seen any tracks of interest other than game tracks. Some of this area is new growth forest. Uh, from the sign I saw, it was harvested 83 and reseeded in 86. So we've got a lot of young spruce out here. Amongst some of the older growth. It's a nice day out. Thermometer says uh, two degrees Celsius, and it's actually supposed to get warmer today, which is nice. We've been kind of blessed so far this winter. I don't mind the snow, but that minus 20, 30, 40 stuff, uh, I'm not too keen on. I have seen a lot of uh, tree arches out here, but to me they just look like they're occurring naturally. It doesn't look like something that's been done intentionally. So I really haven't, uh, I haven't bothered recording those. It just, you know, it's kind of random. It's here, it's there, it's, I just believe it's from wind or you know, the tree's too thin, too tall, and can't support itself, so... Just thought I'd mention it. I have seen some. What I'm kind of keeping my eye out for is any stick structures or anything that looked like it might be a intentionally made shelter. There's a lot of fallen trees out here. So you got to be able to distinguish between what's natural and what's intentionally made. I don't want to say man-made because there's no reason for anybody to stop and build a fort out here. People just don't have the time for that. snow. 
think I might have seen some cougar tracks. They looked a little different than what I've seen out here. I'm not too familiar with cougar, but uh, just going by the shape of them. Large and kind of round, I haven't stopped to examine them. This is uh, the road I met that uh, tracker guy on with his bloodhounds. He was tracking a cougar for one reason or another. He really didn't say. And I didn't ask. There are some uh, oil and gas sites out in this area. So that's why this road is always well plowed. It's a narrow road, but at least it's well plowed. It's still good to have four wheel drive out here. so narrow it's hard to find spots to pull over and you never know if you're gonna see a ditch. I ditched my truck once a while back it looked like this where the snow looked flat and I pulled over and it was a big drop off and I high centered the truck and even with four-wheel drive I couldn't get myself out luckily a guy came along and pulled me out which was nice suck to have to walk all the way back so I just got to be careful where I pull over
right over here. Okay, I'll shut this off, dismount the camera, and go for a bit of a walk. I'll talk to you soon.